Welcome back to the pond project. What's going on with the dump truck? I've got no power steering and no power brakes. Uh oh. Well, as you guys could imagine, a big heavy dump truck full of a lot of dirt is going to need both power steering and brakes. You're going to want to be able to stop. So, uh, oh boy. I feel like every time I come out here to get work done, there's always some problem. I swear, it's insane. If you guys haven't seen it, this is the Team Rar dump truck. I love the logo we made. Rare and ridiculous dumping co because that's what this thing does is it dumps dirt and this logo looks just like the cat logo except it's rar it's like a team rar cat collab kind of and man just look at this thing it is muddy all of this mud is just like dried up on here it's kind of like concrete it's so riddle and look at that stuff a little off-road action there we go off-road it off-road it you thinking you found something or it's low on uh, power steering fluid okay hey Lawrence well that's a great problem to have because that's an easy fix you just hey, you fill it up with fluid so you're using that just to clean it up yeah oh that smells like brake cleaner for sure you just did that to see or just to yeah so then when we start it up we can see if there's like Fluid oh, okay. I'm gonna put the lid back on this because I don't okay. know what's gonna happen if we start it without this on it. I, I have it no just idea. Goosh out. It could just goosh out. Yeah. Make a big mess. Yeah. As if we haven't made a mess already. That's probably a pressure line. Yeah, that's a pressure line. I think coming out of the. Yeah, it's a little wet. It's a little wet at this little fitting here. So maybe the fittings are just kind of not going great because it's the age. Maybe. I mean, that one's definitely our worst one, mm -hmm. for sure. This one might be okay. Shoot. Okay. So our team, our Dumpy Co. is definitely out of business for today. Since I may not be digging today, we might as well uh, scoop a bunch of water and do a waterfall. This is always fun. Look at how much water this bucket holds, guys. Look at this. Oh my gosh. You can literally make it rain. Wow, that's actually really pretty. Oh, it's going way up there. It literally looks like it's raining. What in the world? Oh, that's actually so sick. Okay, we need to try that again. I'm gonna raise it faster this time. I wanna go all the way up. Oh, there was a little rainbow that came out. Is that all the water? Do we have more? Oh, that was about it. That is pretty cool. That's really fun. Sadly, we're turning it off today. So this is the dirt. It looks like it's so dry. Oh, is it crunchy dry? Oh, it's literally crunchy dry. Careful, you go far enough, you're gonna just sink in a sinkhole. It might be quicksand at some point. I mean, you can see how wet it was. This literally is like concrete. Oh, it's still a little bit um, squishy. Oh, yeah, weird. yeah. It's a feature. There's a, it's a, there is some moisture in it. Yeah, that part is. But it's not slop. Yeah, this is the slop. Oh, look at that, just crunchy. This is good. Yeah, Dude, no. we're building a pit bike track this weekend. <laughs> we might have to, honestly. How's she looking? I might be done. Done? Yeah, it was a uh, uh, O-ring. Just an O-ring like failed and yeah, that's the bad one? It's crunchy. It's not as crunchy as I thought it would be, but it had chunks missing out of it, mm. so. And you I just, think that might all, might all, all, all <laughs> that's all it is? That's definitely all that was leaking there. Mm. On that fitting up here. So then if that leak was the problem, then we may be okay? Yeah, so I just put the, uh, um, the fitting back in and tightened it as far as I think it should be. Mm -hmm. And now I'm just putting a fresh hose clamp. I was going to put a new hose on if I had to go to the parts store, but I don't. So I'm just going to use the old hose for now. Right. It's a, the hose is a little crunchy, but it seems like it's, it's still doing all right. It's doing all right enough for, uh, for this. So at least to know if we solved at least the primary leak. Exactly. That's interesting. I didn't expect, uh, that to happen as quickly as that. <laughs> Always underestimating me. 
Well, I mean, with the with the re the magic of the of Matt and the Brown Garage, anything's possible. Yeah, especially when I've got my stock of O-rings over there. We should paint this thing excavator yellow. The whole garage. yeah, it should be excavator yellow. It used to be excavator yellow. Oh, you're talking about this? Yeah, you yeah, can you see can it there. See it I'm talking about the garage. Oh, the garage. It's just the cat oh garage. God. Moment of truth. We're starting it up to see if the steering thing is fixed. right now is probably all that aerated fluid. Uh, whoa. Yeah. It's interesting it comes out when you turn it off. Yeah, I don't know why it does that. I guess it's because it's like high pressure down here. It's releasing oh, like this somehow. Just this just dripped right here. So I'm on to the next one. We got a double failure, two for one special right here. Wouldn't that just be a leak and not necessarily a, a aerated, like a s sucking? Like air would get, would get in on that leak, you think? Um, yeah, so it depends if it's a suction line or a pressure line. If it's pressure, fluid's just gonna go out. Which may be okay, like... For drivability, yeah, yeah. that's okay. A little tight Ooh. on there. Yeah. We'll Maybe see. all it needs. It may, I may wanna just clean that joint up. I don't feel like that's our issue. Oh no, it's not our issue, but it is dripping. So. Yeah. Cause yeah, that looks like a pressure line that comes down from the brakes. Mm -hmm. What's dripping right here? Cause I just saw a drip come out right on this pile. I just saw oh, drip. That's, that's cause of this is, is spewing out. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. But yeah, this one, that could be a bigger, Oh, it's still dripping. Three, four, five. Yeah, it's, it's, it's yeah, dripping. It's just cause everything's really wet. You don't think it's coming out of something? No, dude, there's there's fluid everywhere. It's dripping down, like, a bunch of places. Because it spilled out when you it's poured everywhere. it in? It spilled out here when I took it apart. Oh, uh, when you pulled that it's, line off. It's all, like, okay. everything's soaked. It's going to drip for, like, probably a day or two. Okay. It's because yeah. when you pulled that line off, it was just, you yeah. opened it. Okay. Moment of truth to see if it's actually done now. Feels really good. Yeah. Fingertip. It's so light now. It still feels good? Yep. It feels like a good break. Very healthy. We're, we're good then. Yeah. We're good. That was great. You can shut it off. All right. Now we see just how much surges out the top here. Whoa, yeah, it still does that. Volcano. I don't know how much of that. I mean, is the cap for gonna prevent that? I think so. I, it may be partly me putting too much fluid in, but I it's only put a little bit more and suddenly, you know, it started working, so it seemed like it was low. I think a lot of that's still the aeration, the bubbles working their way out. I think it's gonna get better as we work it. Yeah, I think so too. Cause the bubbles are gonna hopefully rise out. Oh, they will. They'll self come out of this cap. That's why it's got uh, this here. Uh, it kind of gives it room to breathe without letting the fluid out. Okay. She's not too bad to work on. No, it seems great. I was like, I was like this is what we're gonna learn. Whether this thing sucks. Oh, you mean that? Or this? This. Oh. Yeah. Well, that, yeah, that one's not bad either. But I mean, this is how I was like, we're going to learn today. Mm -hmm. First time ever working on it. Just how, like, how annoying is this thing? Honestly, it seems like it's pretty, pretty good. Oh. Yeah, it does, doesn't seem bad. Matt thinks we got the dumpy all figured out. So Matt is taking it on a test drive to see how it does, but we may be able to get back to digging today after all. We are now finally ready to get digging. So let's hop up with the excavator. We got dumpy over there rolling. Let's get the show on the road. It's always exciting to hop in the excavator and start a project. It's so much fun. Oh, here we go. Let's put the little flag out, pull back on the stick, and might as well do one more inaugural waterfall. Yeah. That's cool. So here we go. Let's get the first scoop. Da, 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 da. Boom kind of hard packed. Let's see how it does. Oh, it's dry. It is dry and crumbly. It was super sloppy before. Okay, we're going for the first load into the dump truck and dump. Yeah. All right, one scoop down, lots and lots to go. Pretty much my life now, just an excavator operator. 
digging dirt. Just so much fun stuff we can do with dirt, which probably sounds a little silly, but dirt is so cool. You can make hills, motocross tracks. I mean, I have this crazy idea if we could get enough dirt to literally make a mountain in my back here that's taller than the trees that like you can go like skiing on in the winter if you like put snow and stuff. Because theoretically, if I went tall enough, it would actually have snow because you would be so high elevation. Now, realistically, I want to make one that's taller than the trees, which I think actually could be possible. Maybe not enough that it's cold up there in the winter for snow, but I do want a mountain. I'll call it Mount Rar. I might need bigger equipment, like a bigger dump truck, maybe a huge bulldozer like Whistling Diesel has or something like that. But this is great. We're going to be clocking some hours. It's amazing how well this is drying out. Love to see that. Very much love to see that. I gave Matt a little tap there by accident. This stuff is dry. I bet I could really load that dumpy up. I mean, he's looking pretty heavy, but I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna give him a big old load. All right, I think that will be good to go. Let's take a look. As he pulls away, I can kind of see. Oh, I piled him up high. Oh, <laughs> that thing is great. I piled him up pretty high. So we'll see if he tells me that thing's too heavy of a load or not. We'll see. How was the uh, weight of that load? Super light. Really? Um, if you can give me a little bit of flop, the back of the bed is so like concreted in with dirt. It was really hard to get the tailgate to close. So if, if, I, if it stays that difficult, I may back up to the lake and you could dump water in it to like rinse the, the concrete out a little bit. Um, but yeah, that load was super light. Okay. Cause I, it felt like I loaded you up. Yeah, no, it was, it felt like nothing. I guess cause it's dry, the water is what makes that slop heavy. Yeah, definitely. Okay, well maybe after this load we try rinsing. I don't know how much slop I have for you. Yeah. Yeah, I'll see if it stays difficult. But yeah, if it's difficult this time, I'll back up to the water. And then if you just give me a couple of like bucket loads of water, it'll probably fix it right up. Yeah, maybe it'll soften it and get it out of the way. Yeah, exactly. All right, cool. Yeah, load me up. Back up to Philly. Back up to Philly. Yep. Like I was wondering who that was. Yeah. You got everything? Got everything. Okay, great. Good yeah. boot camp. Boot camp. Good. You have fun digging. Okie doke. Okay, send me pictures. Okay, safe travels. Bye. And she's off. You're stuck with me. So Matt is back, but we're going to try a little bit of a clean here. So we're going to be dumping some water. So those waterfalls that I was doing earlier actually might be uh, something useful. So let's go ahead and fill this bathtub of a bucket up. Boom, full of water. All right, so we are full. And now we are going to, oh gosh. Spilling so much out. Alright, we'll do a couple more of those and see if this rinses it out. And full of water. Great. Oh, we're spilling. We're spilling. Alright, we're gonna try one more bucket. Oops, gotta get more than that. Okay. Let's see how that goes. Even when the bucket's not full and there's just a little bit left, it's amazing how much water actually comes out. It's it's wild. Oh, Better? Okay, Matt said it's better. It may soften up over time as well. We'll see. Well, there he goes. I think I might have loaded him up too much. Oh, Steven's there. What's he doing? Here comes Mr. Ryan Pronti. Ryan 
and it is Hyundai Gini. Let's go say hi to big boy. You thought that was me? He's wearing green, so I just assumed it was you. Look who finally decides to show up. What's up? What are you doing? Digging. Nice. Dig for a few hours. It seems like you're making progress. Yeah, we just started. How much more do you have to do? All of that pile. This pile? That's the last of it. We won't get it all done today, but... So all of this comes out? Yep. That's crazy. Basically just that big pile, and then it's done. And we'll let it fill up, and it'll look good. How deep is it now? Four feet? Four or five, yeah. It's gonna be a good, good old days? lake. How many more days? One day today, and you'll be done. No, it'll need another full day. And just like that, Nat is back, ready for more dirt. We gotta keep going. Oh man, strapped up, keychain, and dick. I just found something interesting. That, is that a log? I don't know what that is. It looks really interesting. Let's try to pick it up. There it is. I think it is like a log tree trunk or something. And uh, she happened again. She getting stuck. It bumped down again. Uh, I didn't notice. Dang. It was holding fine, and then bleh, once it got weighed on it. Back up to here and dump it. Yeah. Here we go. Dump truck load scooped in and back here. It's kind of a waste, but it's all good. Stuck. All right, I'm gonna give him a push. Oh, you can see that tire under there spinning. Oh, all right. He got out. If he got stuck, it's a good place that I could just push him with the bucket. But uh, that was good. And we are about wrapped, just in time for the rain. You can see it raining. I gotta show Steven the little thing. Don't be jealous. <laughs> How cool is that? That's cool. It's the coolest keychain ever. I am surprised that you took it out of the packaging. Da 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 da. Huh? Da, 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 da. The rain is really starting to come down, so we barely got this job done, and then all of that's gonna have to sit outside in a lot of the rain because we're getting dumped on for the next week. Tons of rain. We're not gonna be able to dig, we're gonna have to pick this up for one last session to get this project done. But it won't be for a couple weeks. But it is looking pretty good. Just one last mountain of mud to do. What's the max you can go without tipping? <laughs> Gosh, that's a lot further than I would think. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I would not have expected to go that. Oh my God. <laughs> it's nice to know I can tilt that much. <laughs> Oh, the ground is so sloppy. It's really bad. Oh my, okay. All right, that's just ridiculous. That's like a thumbnail right there. We might need to do a thumbnail on that. Oh my God. Chris, what are you doing? <laughs> Settle down. It's a little sloppy. <laughs> He's gonna make it worse. Oh my God. This thing makes a slop mess. Yep. Oh, don't do that. That can't make it better. <laughs> That's making it worse. All right, someone needs to get him out of the car. Let's take him to the field. I know, we should take him to the field. Yeah, that's all it's gonna do. Oh, God. There you go, the grass is back in the hole now. All right, there you go. He's dying to dig something. Yeah, we gotta get him to a hole. It's a slot fest in a straight line. Dude, yeah, making this turn was so hard not to make big ruts. It's gonna. I mean, winning straight looks gross. It was worse. I kind of smoothed them out. Somebody else already made a mess. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Who, I don't know who that was. <laughs> <laughs> they were in here like, <laughs> Yeah. 
yeah, we gotta go take this to the far end of the playground. Yeah, yeah it doesn't got, help that it just ruined. Area in the back that we can make into a nice little mud hole. Yeah, that's the the back of the backyard. Back of the back the of back, the back. The back. Way back. That's the way back. Yeah.